Hi, uh, this is Haiying Gao, uh, Associate Professor at the University of Massachusetts Amherst. I'm a geophysicist and a seismologist at the Department of Geoscience. For my research, I mainly focus on um, the Earth's crust and mantle um, in order to understand the, how the continent was formed and has been evolving through geological time. My current research project focuses on global subduction zones and also the East and North American continent. At the subduction zones, this is where the two tectonic plates converge toward each other. For example, in this figure, the oceanic plate is subducting beneath the overriding continental plate. At subduction zones, this is where the large earthquakes and volcanoes have been observed. So for my research, I focus to understand how the subducting plate has been affecting or deforming the overriding plate. For my research project, it includes six uh, subduction zones, including the New Zealand subduction region, the Aleutia Alaska subduction region, the Cascadia subduction zone, and the Central American margin, the South American margin, and also the Caribbean subduction system. By looking at these six subduction zones, it allows me to compare the similarities and differences among the subduction zones and to understand the general features of subduction system. My another research interest is to understand the growth and evolution of a continental crust through geological time. The East and North American continent provide a great tectonic setting to study this uh, subject. This region re recorded a complete tectonic cycle from the breakup of a supercontinent, mm -hmm. which we call Rondinia about 1 million years ago to the formation of the modern Atlantic Ocean. In order to uh, carry out the uh, above su research subject I summarized, we simulate the wave propagation from the um, seismic source, which usually refer to the earthquakes, to the seismic receivers. By doing this, the seismic propagation, it records the information about the structure of the Earth. We call those models the seismic tomography models. A seismic tomography model is very similar as a medical CAT scan. But instead of using the X-rays, we use the seismic waves. The seismology lab involves quite the training of quite a few graduate students, a postal and a few undergraduate students. Here I list the um, previous and current PhD, MS PhD student at my postal. Sam Pass was a former PhD student who is doing a, a postal work at a different institute now. Sam Pass focused on the um, Cascadia subduction zone at the New Zealand region for his PhD dissertation. Tony Lee was another former PhD student. He is also currently doing a postal um, research at a different institution in China. Tung's research focused on to understand the formation and evolution of uh, continental lithosphere, spe specifically focused on the East and North American continent. Xiao so Tao was a former postal researcher with me uh, since 2011 to, to from 2015. Xiao so Tao is currently an assistant professor at Purdue University. So total research at UMass focused on the Aleutia Alaska subduction margins. Elena was my former PMS student who is currently doing a PhD program at a different university. Elena's research focused on understanding the thickness of the crust in the southwestern United States. Meng Liu is my current PhD student. She got her master's degree in my group. 
most research focus on understanding the subduction systems. Specifically, she focused on the entire South American margin at the Alaska subduction system. So uh, in addition to these few students, I summarized here, the MGHPCC also provide training to quite a few undergrad students who has been uh, working in my group last few years. Thank you.